Hey guys, this is Chris with CricketUsers.com, the US Tech Channel. Today I have the Samsung Galaxy uh, S4 on the left here. On the right I have the HTC One. We've already set up uh, AT&T Visual Voicemail on it. Uh, we also uh, talked about on that video uh, AT&T Messages. Some people don't like AT&T Messages because they say it takes over your, your text uh, application. There is a way around that and we'll show that uh, for each of these phones. But for those of you that just want a standalone application, to go ahead and handle your visual voicemail so that you can play, rewind, uh, restart at any any spot in a, in a voicemail and delete uh, on the fly just like you would a text message. Um, we have the uh, AT&T uh, visual voicemail application on the Play Store that we can download. Now if you've already set up AT&T messages it's probably going to tell you that um, that's kind of already uh, taken over uh, in order to reset up anything else uh, for the visual voicemail, specifically the AT&T visual voicemail app, you will have to go in uh, to your settings and then um, application manager you'll have to find the AT&T messages and basically uh, you're going to clear data on it and that should allow you to go ahead and set up the AT&T visual voicemail uh, standalone application. So let's go to our Play Store. Turn back on the Wi-Fi. We were doing a benchmark a little bit earlier, so we went ahead and turned that off. NT Visual Voicemail. We'll go ahead and download this. So this video is a little messy. I do apologize. I'm really running on a minimal amount of sleep here. Uh, once it downloads it, open it up. Go ahead and hit Call Voicemail. Basically, it uses this to authenticate that you have access to your voicemail. So, we won't have to go through this. We can actually hit end call. I let it play for a little bit. And then go ahead and cancel it. And it'll say uh, AT&T comes with AT&T Visual Voicemail and continue. It's pretty much already set up. Uh, we can do a four digit password. So it does need my mobile data to be on. Let's go update my account. Now I can set up my personal greeting. I can also add a home uh, screen shortcut. We'll go ahead and click finish. And here's my first message. Voicemail provides an email-like inbox that lets you listen to your voicemail messages in any order you choose. You can also upgrade this service to transcribe your voicemail messages to text so you can read or listen to them. For more information or to add the visual voicemail with text feature, call AT&T Customer Care at 1-800-331-0500 or contact your corporate help desk. As you can see on visual voicemail, Add the visual voicemail with text. you can forward, rewind, do whatever you want, uh, delete certain voicemails and uh, leave the rest alone, mark them as new, or even save them. So for a standalone visual voicemail application, uh, if you're an AT&T subscriber, go ahead, go to Google Play and download the AT&T visual voicemail application. For more information on this device and more, please like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.